Hello everyone, my name is Muriwa Dayo. I am an educational neuroscientist. I am also a lecturer. Okay, this morning I have a very critical and, and, and extremely important topic to discuss with us. The topic is titled Educational Neuroscience Approach. Okay, Brain Led Teaching and Learning. I repeat, Educational Neuroscience Approach, Brain Led, -led Teaching and Learning. Uh, so, but before I go deeply, okay, into expatiating or expatiating, okay, this topic, I would like to, okay, as a tradition, okay, ask some questions and um, after asking these questions, I shall try to do what? To give answers to each of the questions. So the first question, okay, in this video is what is educational neuroscience? Educational neuroscience is simply, okay, the process of the teaching, the process of of a lecturing whereby the brain okay be, okay becomes the center stage okay of our pedagogy of our teaching because simply education is a brain development education is brain transformation the capacity to transform our natural brains into brain power is what education is all about so every educational system every school system has been tailored to make sure that our brains are, are transformed into brain power so then the second question becomes what is educational neuroscience approach educational neuroscience approach simply means okay putting the brain okay at the center stage of education Educational neuroscience approach simply, okay, I repeat, simply it means putting the brain, okay, at the center stage, that letting the brain, okay, become the sign issue of our teaching, of our pedagogy. And how do we do this? First and foremost, we need to actually understand, okay, the brain and how the, the brain, okay, okay, uh, helps us, okay, in academic learning, okay, uh, it, uh, academic learning, okay, academic development, it is it. The first thing is this, okay, that the brain loves, okay, a conducive environment. The brain loves, okay, a stressless environment. Uh, so uh, the first point okay, with regard to educational, uh, educational new science approach has to do with the fact that the learning environment should be stress-free. Then secondly, it is important for us to understand that uh, dopamine, okay, is a neurotransmitter, okay, of pursuit. It's a neurotransmitter of reward. So by aligning, okay, our pedagogy, okay, uh, uh, with, with this dopamine consciousness, okay, will make our pedagogy extremely effective. So thank you very much.